I'm David Carnoy, executive editor for CNET.com, and I'm here with the Geneva Sound System XS. That XS stands for extra small. Uh, this company is a Swiss company. It usually makes actually really big speakers, but this is a small Bluetooth speaker, and it looks a lot like those old school travel alarm clocks. It folds up into its own case, um, and it's really kind of a nifty design. Uh, you can take this with you, put it in your bag. It's protected. Uh, it also has a built-in FM radio and a telescoping antenna. It's a little weird that it sticks out the side, but uh, it is cool that it does have an antenna and you can get better reception with that antenna. A couple of other features, there is an audio input so you can uh, use devices that don't have Bluetooth with it. Uh, that cable isn't included, however. Like other portable Bluetooth speakers, this one has a built-in rechargeable battery. It is a lithium-ion rechargeable battery. It gives you about five hours worth of battery life. Um, that's not great, but it's not bad either, and you can always leave the speaker plugged in as well. One of the things it doesn't have is speakerphone capabilities. There's no built-in mic here like the Jawbone Jambox has. This is slightly bigger than the Jawbone Jambox. It weighs 1.1 pounds, uh, but it's very portable, and it does sound better than the Jambox. Uh, this one has a little bit more detail to it. It's a little warmer sounding, um, and it handles bass better. It also plays very loud for its size. Take all that with a grain of salt, of course. Uh, these smaller speakers don't have a lot in the way of stereo separation, um, and they don't sound fantastic, but the idea here is that they do sound big for their size. You can stream audio from your iPad, your iPhone, your, your Android smartphone, um, and it sounds a lot, lot better than those internal speakers on those devices. One of the small drawbacks worth pointing out is that it doesn't charge via USB. It comes with its own AC adapter. Uh, it would be nice if it had a USB charger so you could carry only one cable with your cell phone charger, but it does come with that AC adapter. The other bigger downside is its price. It is a $250 device. Uh, this is from a Swiss company. Uh, it is a high quality, well-made product, but that $250 price will scare off some people. But if you don't mind paying that much for a cool, small Bluetooth speaker, uh, this one is definitely worth checking out. I'm David Carnoy, and that's the Geneva Sound System XS. On the outside, Geneva sound is deceptively simple, but inside, it's sophisticated and versatile. The Swiss engineers fuse many functions all in one single cabinet. They use advanced electronics, patented acoustics, the best amplifiers, speakers, and tuners. Geneva cabinetry is high quality furniture. The wood cabinets are made by hand. Each takes a week to complete. The woodworkers pay meticulous attention to detail. The genuine American walnut is hand sanded. The lacquer is applied by hand. The wood cabinets are hand buffed. Each one is hand polished. It's a dedication to innovation and quality craftsmanship. So Geneva products will be enjoyed for years to come. This is a review of the Geneva Audio Extra Small, which is a battery, all mains powered portable radio with Bluetooth um, audio ability. Um, picked this up a couple of days ago um, for my partner for her birthday. Um, she uses it around the house um, or in, in our son's bedroom to help him put him to sleep with some classical music or any other sort of music. Um, I'll just put the camera down, but basically this, this radio comes into a fold-out design and to actually activate it you need to put in these little teeth things that fit into it and that actually activates the power, which is handy because it puts it to sleep whilst, um, whilst it's... Um, put into the storage. sort of resembles the sort of old travel clocks of years gone by. Um, also, on the side is a um, focuser. Um, we have the aerial here, which feels a little bit flimsy, but I, one would hope it will last its lifetime. Lifetime being 
I don't know, 10, 20 years, hopefully beyond that. But it seems to be okay just to be very gentle. I often leave this rodeo left open on a mantelpiece. Um, as you can see, it's bigger, brother, the Geneva Audio Small, it's seen here. So, um, once you turn it on, there's a little indented button, which is sort of um, following on the same sort of as the series as here with the bigger brother. Um, once you press this, it gives you a few seconds to activate and load its firmware, I guess. At the moment, it's on radio. You've got a series of buttons here. Volume, um, the, um, adjusting the clock mode for changing it from line-in mode, Bluetooth receiving or radio, and then here for tuning the station. Um, I could try the Bluetooth. Um, I don't know if I've got anything connected to it at the moment because I've got a couple of iPods and sometimes it can confuse um, the different modes. So, I'll just... so let's have a look if I push this, which is similar to um, Air, um, airport Extreme, well not Airport Extreme, um, oh, I can't remember what they call it, but anyway, it's using Bluetooth. I have a similar setup with my stereo, which uses um, uh, the Apple Air um, codec. So, play this. So that's now playing through this little thing here. There's a little blue flashing light here that comes up periodically to tell you if the battery's okay, and the more it flashes, the the, the the need for a charge is there. Um, it can go quite loud. Um, I mean, obviously, you know, the viewers of this will like different types of music and probably won't appreciate this music, but tough. <laughs> um, it basically consists of a waffler. I wouldn't call it a subwoofer, um, but a woofer and two tweeters which do the mid range and the highs. Um, just down in this corner, there's a picture on the internet I've seen of it taken apart. As where the bigger unit here just has two um, full range drivers. Um, but the audio quality is good. If I compare it with um, its bigger brother, I'll give it a bit of beans. Or, um, and then turn it off and then plug it into the bigger one. Just um, unfortunately I'm using a Canon SLR camera which hasn't got a proper microphone attached to it so it won't do it any justice but there is a bit of sound quality difference but um, the crisp sort of highs are basically the same so anyway that concludes my review for this little radio um, perfect for a person who probably has it on a desk or travels quite a bit and like to have a travel clock as well. Um, I don't think there's any negatives about it, only that the aerial is slightly, that slight feeling that it could break after time just because of, you know, moving parts. Um, but then it also gives the, the radio a bit of character um, once it's, um, yeah, there. Um, some people have reported that radio reception isn't that great, but I found it to be okay. In fact, Radio reception is actually better than this um, Geneva Small, which is actually plugged up to an external aerial outdoors. But maybe that's because I haven't got it set right. Okay, well, thanks for enjoying watching my video, and um, feel free to look at any other videos that I have. Thank you. Hi there, and welcome to New Fidelity Bowman Sydney Australia's YouTube channel. My name is Zach. And we're here today to take a look at the Geneva Model XS from Geneva Lab. Geneva Lab are a team of designers out of Switzerland who are passionate about creating high quality audio products for users with contemporary lifestyles. Their products are all about neat little packages like this with features uh, in nice cabinets with, in a variety of colours and finishes. Enough about Geneva and more about their latest creation, the Model XS. Uh, inspired by the ever popular travel clock that used to be around, uh, this clamshell wrapped leather case, which is about the size of a glass case, uh, features a fold out speaker, which is portable, it's got a battery inside and a power 
pack to recharge it. Uh, features FM radio. It comes with a nice aerial. It pops out. FM radio. Um, it's an alarm clock, as we said, to the time. Uh, but most importantly, it has Bluetooth audio streaming. One of the most important things I've got to mention earlier about the Geneva XS is the sound quality. For something its size, it puts out what we think is a great sound. It's incredible. Um, I'll give you a quick demo. I don't know if you can hear it on the other side of that camera. But there we are. Probably the coolest portable speaker that we've heard in this price range. Great price, cool features, take it with you, battery operated. Um, yeah, we love it. Why would you buy the Geneva Model XS? Well, it's a perfect travel companion. It works with any Bluetooth device, whether it's your PC, Mac, Android, anything with Bluetooth pretty much. But yeah, as I said, great travel companion. You rock up at your hotel room and you want some audio, this is going to do it. Fits in your briefcase. It's available in white, black, and the ever popular red. It's available for purchase on our online store, www.newfidelity.com.au. Uh, if you're in Sydney, Australia, pop over to our Bowman showroom, check it out. And uh, that's all from us, and we'll talk to you soon. Thanks.